Hello everyone, very good morning and very warm welcome to my channel. Guys, before I start today's video, I request all of you to subscribe the channel. If you really appreciate the videos prepared by us, then do like, comment and share them with others. And guys, today's video is on IELTS Rail Exam Writing Task 2, which was conducted on 18th November 2023. Let's start with the statement first. Some people believe that all wild animals should be protected. Others say that few wild animals should be protected in skeg. Discuss both views and give your opinion. Being the superior creation of God, humans are responsible for the care of the animals which they do, either making and abiding by laws or by keeping them in protected zones. However, some people think that it is impractical to care all wild animals due to limited resources, so focus should be on few ones. To start with, human activities are against the survival of all wild animals such as deforestation for the sake of commercialization, accommodation or hunting and poaching for the selfish motives. These are threats in maintaining biodiversity and ecosystem stability. So, removing any species from an ecosystem can have cascading effects on the entire ecological balance. Apart from this, Environmental damage by humans is also deteriorating the habitat of all wild animals. Therefore, all animals require the conservation, otherwise their existence may be threatened, including deer, lion, etc. On the contrary, few animals are on the verge of extinction, so more attention should be on their conservation. The initiatives must be taken to preserve these animals on priority basis such as tigers, black deer, etc. Otherwise, we may lose them forever. Besides, it is our ethical responsibility to protect the diversity of life on earth. This is the reason that these animals are kept in the zoos where their care is taken properly besides having breeding programs to save them from extinction. Limited resources available ensures the effectiveness of the conservation programs, which otherwise may be compromised. In conclusion, the wild animals are must for the ecological balance, so there is need to take steps to save them. The safety measures must be taken as per the requirement or more efforts must be taken to save the endangered ones first. Simultaneously, the natural habitat of these animals must be maintained so that all animals can live there freely. So guys, this is all about today's video. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe the channel, like, comment and share the video.